Good morning, everybody. All right, I think we are on day 14 with our sprouts and seeds. And I wanted to give you guys a status check. So let's take a look at what we got. These are the two red beans that we put into the pots just a few days ago. Now, you'll see this one is way taller than this one, and this one has lost its seed pod. So I was worrying about this one, the one that's smaller, and I'm like, why isn't it growing as much? So I observed, I noted all my observations. I observed that this one is growing taller, that its leaves are coming out and starting to open up, and this one isn't growing as quickly. And then I touched the soil. So I put my finger in there, which is kind of messy, got me dirty, and I realized I think I over watered this bean. So it's possible to put too much water in, which I guess I didn't fully realize when I was pouring the water in. So I don't know what's going to happen. I'm hoping that this one will dry out a little bit and then it will start growing. It's also possible that maybe it will stop growing. So we'll have to see. So we'll let it keep going. Maybe it'll catch up to the other one. So we'll compare these two in a little bit and see what's going on. So those are our bean sprouts that are in the pots. They look really good though. So I'm gonna put them back in their sunny spot over here. All right, let's check our other red beans. And here, oh goodness, wow. All right, we are going to have to move them, not right now because I don't have the stuff ready, but, oops, here we go. Let's see if I can get it to that. I don't know why my computer does that. But they are definitely ready. Oh, they're a jumbly mess. They are definitely ready to go into pots themselves. So I'll have to get some pots ready and maybe next time we'll put them in their pots or maybe I'll just do it and I'll show you guys. Wow, hmm, I have to say, I think I like doing them in the baggy method best because these guys are kind of a mess. They didn't really get to grow very much. Maybe I'll leave it open a little bit more for them so they have more room to grow up. So there, so I put them in there without the paper towel on top. Okay, I had to put a little more water in there too because I think they're a little dry. All right, let's see, wild rice. I was asking my dad if we thought wild rice would grow and he said he didn't think so. So I don't know, I'm getting a little discouraged with it. But like we said, there's no harm in doing it. Mm, they just look kind of gross in there. Not gross enough yet to throw away, but I'm not holding out a lot of hope on the wild rice. Kind of smelling a little bit too. I have a feeling the wild rice is gonna end up in the garbage, but we'll cover it back up, stick it back in the sun, and unless it gets too stinky, it can stay. All right, last thing was the navy beans that we transferred over and put in the baggie with the moist paper towel. Oh, my paper towel is drying out, so I'm gonna have to check that. So let's see what we've got. Oh! Look guys, they've got little roots. So what I've noticed, what I've observed, is that the first thing to come out of beans is, let's go closer maybe, there we go, is their roots. So their roots come out first, and then after their roots get quite long is when the little green sprout starts to come out. So let's look at it from this angle. So they're coming along nicely. So I'm gonna put a little more water on them after I stop recording with you guys and put them back in the sun. And hopefully by the next time we record, they will be even more rooty and getting ready to sprout their sprouts. All right, so this is my video journal of how our beans are going for day 14. All right, see you guys in a couple days. Bye.